Hello, in this video we'll briefly discuss a new selection mechanism introduced in a fresh 240 update. The way of object selection has been revised to improve usability in most important cases. Now when you click on an object, the whole object is selected as a group and not a separate part. Thus it has become more convenient to interact with the object as a single entity. For example, you can select the entire car model to move it, not its separate wheel, at which the mouse click was made. You can go inside the group with a double click. After that, you can select the object's parts, one at a time or several at once if multi-selection is used. Along with this, a new rectangle selection mode has been added. With this mode you can select all the objects overlapped by the rectangle drawn on the screen. There is also new functionality to work with a scene hierarchy. First, the group of parts that make up the object can be disbanded into a set of free objects. To do this, use the ungroup command in the context menu. One or more free objects can be put into a new group. To do this, select them and use the create group command. So, you can restructure the hierarchy to simplify the manipulation of scene objects. Finally, free objects can be added to an existing group by selecting them and using the put in group command. We hope you enjoy this update and look forward to your thoughts and reactions. Please let us know what you think in the comments, and see you in the following videos.